Hello everyone, it's Kyoto the Gravity. A miserable raining day today. Heavy raining. Um, we installed a Evo CarPlay system for um, Mercedes S Class. Uh, this is 2006 to 2008 S Class um, NTG3 model. Let's have a look. Back to their time, it's got a digital cluster, it's actually very cool. Um, yeah, so this is the old NTG3 uh, system for W221S class. So let's have a look. Yeah, so that's, that, this is the system. So basically this is a New Zealand new car, New Zealand local car. Um, got a New Zealand map. And um, let's just put into the uh, UX as normal, so we know it's for Apple CarPlay system. So press the long, long press this button to get into the Apple CarPlay menu. Yeah, it's pretty clear, right? For more than ten years old, the screen. This is a really clear view of the Apple CarPlay and the Android Auto interface. So now, let's just move to my cell phone Bluetooth. Just get it connected, right? So, you know, probably connect it here, probably easier. Just connected via the Bluetooth. Cool. Let's have a look. That's it. It's on. Apple CarPlay system for Mercedes NTG3 S Class. It's probably one of the um, not first one in the world, but uh, one of the early ones, you know, in the world um, uh, with the right-handed drive S Class, old S Class model. We installed Apple CarPlay. Excellent result, as normal, crystal clear, high resolution, Google Map factory um, control back you know can can go back um, radio Spotify as normal hey Siri use Google map uh, take me to airport Pretty cool, right? As always. Look at that. Beautifully done. Old S Class with Apple CarPlay system. Obviously, can use Android Auto uh, with my Samsung somewhere. But yeah, Samsung, um, you know, um, or Android phone can be connected for Android Auto. Similar results, but Apple CarPlay wirelessly connected. Perfect result.